Welcome to the video, my friends. Today, we're going to go over a cheesy way to kill General Rodan. I had a lot of trouble with Rodan myself. I tried going in heavy and fast. Didn't work. So what we're going to do is just kite him around and use the AI or the NPCs that help us in there. Keep spawning them in and give him a bunch of rot, which kills him over time pretty quick, actually. And what we're going to want to do is go to the Church of Dragon Communion in the rot zone and get rotten breath. And you do need one dragon heart to purchase this. You get those by killing any dragon in the world. Uh, you should have one hopefully by now if you're in this area of the game. There is a dragon close to the church as well. So you can get a heart, purchase it with one heart. For Rotten Breath, you will need 15 Faith and 12 Arcane. I did a couple of extra levels in Faith and Arcane just to get those uh, skills up there. My class is the Confessor, so I started with a Finger Seal, and you will need one of these or an equivalent item to actually use the Rot Breath. So all we want to do now is get into the game, which I've got the live gameplay from my stream at twitch.tv slash Falcon on the fight with Radan, you just want to get your friendly NPCs in there, all of the NPCs throughout the game up to this point that you've managed to talk to and got on your side. They will fight for you on the battlefield against General Radan. Dodge all of Radan's attacks. Some of them really hit hard, even at my higher level of 65, 70. They were really hammering me. In phase two, he can nearly pretty much one-tap you straight away. He does amazing, ridiculous combos and will destroy you very quick. So stay away, wait for an opening with your friends, Give him a full blast of that dragon rot breath and he will start to tick down. Once he gets that pink mist around his head and his body, you know he's infected and you'll see every second his health will tick down. You've got to do this each round. So when his health gets to half, it'll be the second round of the fight. He'll become even stronger and do mental combos and you want to do the same dragon rot breath on him again until he starts to tick down every second. That health goes down, down, down. Keep that NPC uh, getting the aggro off of you onto them. Uh, keep spawning those in. You want to run around, keep spawning those in. Keep good distance between you and Rodan. He does do some massive jump attacks and also a massive wave attack as well that can knock you off your horse, leaving you super vulnerable. So you want to keep very aware of those attacks and keep your distance and keep moving to his side. Anyway, without me rambling on, I'll leave you to enjoy the rest of the gameplay of me beating Rodan and uh, just show you how I played it. And hopefully this helps you get past him if this is a way of helping you. And you can also get his armor as well at the Two Finger Lady back at the round table. I hope this helps you. Enjoy the gameplay. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button if this helped you. And you want to see more of my content. I love you all. And I'll see you peeps next time. Yeah, I've got him poisoned now. Sometimes I find Radan and those arrows take a third of my health, but and other times it's just outright kill. Yeah, it just doesn't make sense. Phase two. Get on the fucking oh 
Oh my god. You should be poisoned. Fucking better be. Run for your fucking life. Got him. GG's. That took way longer than it should have, I know that. <laughs> I was having too much fun slaughtering those little babies. That sounded wrong. Uh...